It's Ben Meyerson. I'm here reporting at Bucks training camp. Uh, we're heading into the last preseason game versus the Ravens. Uh, first couple things out of practice where John Wolford is back. He is practicing in full. Uh, he's got full pads on. He looks good. He looked comfortable out there. Uh, didn't have any restrictions. Uh, Kalaja Kansi is at practice. He's not in pads quite yet. He's still in shorts. Uh, so we're still waiting to hear back from him. Um, but he is, you know, he has no braces. Uh, he has no, nothing like that. He's walking around uh, and he looks mobile. We did see Ryan Jensen today. Um, still no update. And he was pretty far away from us where we were standing on the field. So we couldn't quite, quite get a good view of him and uh, couldn't see whether he was in a brace or not. Um, and then um, offensive install started pretty well. Baker had a really good day uh, with the installs. He had four touchdowns over the course of about five or six completions. Uh, really, really good stretch from him there. So the team had some uh, offensive installs for a while then. They went over to red zone work where Baker looked better than Trask's today. Uh, Trask did have a better completion percentage, but Baker had a drop um, and he had a throw away. So it, he ended up uh, making the right decision on those plays. But Trask still looks a little uncomfortable in the red zone, doesn't look quite so mobile. Uh, and then in 11 on 11s, Trask was 9 of 14 today. Uh, he looked good for stretches and he looked bad for stretches. You know, he, uh, he had some nice completions. He was looking a little more mobile in 11s but he also had a dropped interception as well which was not a uh, not a good throw at all it was really bad uh, and then we had baker finishing up uh, with 11 on 11s and baker was really really good he was a of 12 on the day connecting a lot with mike evans with chris godwin he's building up a lot of chemistry with them it's looking better and better each day uh, like i said eight of 12 but two of those were drops uh, so realistically you know he had a, a fantastic day if you take away those drops uh, you know that's eight of ten so yeah good day overall baker you know obviously was named qb1 yesterday and he looked the part today so a uh, good day from him and uh, we'll see what happens tomorrow.